Hello guys, welcome to PHP Basics. In this lecture, section 2.3, I'll show you how to use an iframe in your website. So an iframe is used to embed another document within the HTML document. So uh, I will show you three examples. The first one, how to embed a website, how to embed a video, and how to embed a map. So to get started, I'll create a div and a class container and inside I'll put an h2 just to show you the examples so now we'll do a website and the span I want how to embed a website so to be able to embed the website you just use the tag iframe well, iframe src stands for the path I'll show you the example of Google it won't work but I'll show you the example frame border I want it zero it's the border of the frame and I want the width at 100% and I want the height at 50% so if we try this we should be able uh, google.com is blocked okay refuse to connect and the reason why it's because there's a lot of scams on the internet that what they do they make you think that this is the real website and the legitimate website and they make you uh, they used your information to be able to hack or uh, to grab personal information about the user so uh, there's so many ways to see if it's a real website or not uh, first of all on the address bar if it's not the legi legitimate website, let's say you're on Google and you see here like Tommy.Brandon.com, uh, it's not Google. And the second one is, you see the icon right here, there's uh, usually there's a, there's a lock on it with the green uh, and color green. And if you click on it, you should be able to see the SSL certificate. That means that this domain has been verified and secured by SSL. And the third, third way to see it, if you right click and you see, uh, you check the page source, if there's no content on the website, there's nothing, only an iframe, that means they're using another website on their website. So this is another reason, uh, another way to see it. Uh, but be careful, like uh, reseller programs like GoDaddy, it happened to me, I used to have a reseller account in GoDaddy that I sell domains and hosting services. And GoDaddy, they give me an iframe. So in my domain, in my website, let's say Bluehost, I had GoDaddy embedded inside and there's a lot of clients that were scared to purchase any domains for me because because of this reason and there's a guy even he put a comment uh, he, he put it actually on google that this is a scam it's an iframe it wasn't a scam it's a real iframe from the godaddy account so sometimes it's not a scam sometimes it is so uh, now I'll show you how to embed uh, a video into your website. So you just go to share in your video, embed, copy this link, and then you're just going to paste it here. And also the width, I'll change it to 100% and the height, I want it 50%. And you have so much options too that you can play with but uh, in this video I won't be able to show you if we go back refresh so this is the video that we embedded from YouTube and you can also play the video you can also full screen so it's the same like you're on YouTube and the third one is how to embed a map so for example, you go to Google map, I want Montreal, Canada, and then I want, let's say, I don't know, I can keep it like this, or I can pinpoint this location right here. And then I want to share it, you click on share, 
share and I want to embed this location right here I just copy HTML go back to my code and paste it have to embed the map I want the width also 100% and the height I want it at 50% I go back I refresh and here is my map with my current pinpoint location you can customize um, your map more but uh, if you want some advanced customization now Google will charge you for it uh, you need to use an API and depending of, of the number of views uh, that you have on the website on the map itself uh, Google will start to charge you uh, I think uh, about last year they came with it so a lot of website that you go on you see that this is only for development purposes and that means that they had an API of a customized map but Google now they charge you for it or you have like for example the, the first hundred uh, views on the map it's free and then they will charge you for an example like let's say one cent each of you so uh, this is it for today uh, in the future I'll be able to show you how to embed the map with different locations depending on your client if it's if he's in Canada in US in Australia uh, any location uh, I'll show you with PHP how to be able to to iframe uh, the map depending on the location of your your user. Thank you very much for watching.